Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. The NVIDIA Shield TV is easily one of the best streaming devices out there. But that Netflix button on the remote? Well, it's one of the most common complaints I see. So in this video, I'll show you how to take that same button and turn it into a shortcut for any app you want, like YouTube, Plex, or in this example, Kodi. Let's jump in. Every Shield owner knows this one. You grab the remote and that Netflix button gets pressed by accident. It happens constantly. Now, instead of disabling it, you can make it useful. With a quick setup, you can make it open any app you choose, whatever you actually use most. To do this, we're using a free app called Button Mapper. So head to the Google Play Store on your Shield, search for Button Mapper and install it. Once it's installed, open it up. You'll see a message asking you to turn on something called Accessibility Service. Click OK and that will open your settings. Now just follow these steps. Go to Device Preferences, Accessibility, scroll down to Button Mapper, toggle Enable to On, click OK to confirm once that's done, then back out and you'll be returned to the Button Mapper app ready to customize your remote. Next, scroll down to add buttons and select it. You'll see an option that says add buttons. Click that and when it says press button to add, press the Netflix button on your remote. Now it should appear as button 12. Go ahead and click on that. If you're asked to upgrade to the Pro version, choose No Thanks because everything we're doing works with the free version of the app. Now turn Customize on. You'll see three actions you can change. Single tap, double tap, and long press. Now here's the setup I recommend. Set single tap to no action. Set double tap to no action. And set long press to applications. Then choose the app you want to open when pressing this button. I'm choosing Kodi for this example, but you can select YouTube, Plex, Disney Plus, or whatever app you want that button to open. Now, before testing it, scroll back to the main button mapper screen, go down to troubleshooting, and make sure alternate button handling is turned on. Now that's what makes it work properly on the NVIDIA Shield. Now let's try it out. Tap the Netflix button, nothing. Double tap, still nothing. But hold it down for a second and your chosen app launches instantly. It's simple, it's free and it completely changes how that button works. And since we're talking about streaming, here's a quick tip. If you want to unlock even more content on Netflix or other apps, you'll need NordVPN. It's what I use on my Shield and Fire Stick to safely access global Netflix libraries and streaming services without buffering. You'll find my NordVPN link in the description. It supports the channel and gets you a big discount. So that's how to change the Netflix button on your NVIDIA Shield remote to open any app you want. 
If this helped you out, give the video a thumbs up and subscribe for more streaming tutorials and tips. You can also check out my other channel, Tanders Tech, follow me on X, and join channel memberships to get access to our private members only group chat. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. Shield TV owners, this one's for you. NVIDIA just pished out a new... What? Pished? Pished out. <laughs>